Hello, sweeties. This is Lessa Simmers with The Sims Castaway Stories. I believe that this is episode four, I think. Um, um, and to be honest, I don't know where we left off. I know that we went into the jungle and, um, and gave monkeys bananas and took their idol. So she wants to examine the idol now. Let's take a look at her stats. Right now she's eating because her hunger is kind of low. She needs to use the toilet and she needs to have some fun. So let's see, what else does she want to do? She wants to get a bookcase, get level 6 in cooking, and be safe from death. I don't think that that one's going to happen. But, so, the first thing we're going to do is press play, and then, I'm going to have her study cooking, and then, I don't think we can get a bookcase just yet, but we can examine the idol. So, I hope you're all enjoying this series. Um, like I said before, I played it all the way through once, and it wasn't that bad it's it's not it's not even that very long um, it took me probably two or three days of playing it for you know three or four hours and a piece and her chest looks empty she's got what is that Looks like she's got coconuts and strawberries and papayas in there. So we're going to speed through this. And there's her cooking spell skill. We'll just have her do this for a while. Um she's not very tired that's probably enough here in a minute okay she's gonna examine that idol oh no actually she already did let's see what it says P for pause oh one of your jewels is missing. Don't worry, it's the imperfections that make us special. Oh, you want to know what I do for a living? Uh, well, I guess you could say that I'm, uh, self-employed. Yeah. You're calling me a liar? You can't just throw out words like lazy and clinging to false hope to a rescue. I'm trying. Spalding has a valid point. I need to come up with a plan for day-to-day -day survival until I finish my raft. So now it appears that she needs to plan survival. In order to do that, uh, to plan survival, click on the castaway and select career. Select one uh, of the three paths. Each will path will provide food and resources but in different combinations so let's click on career become a hunter become a gatherer become a crafter um, let's become a crafter Okay, and then 
I don't know why she has this fascination with ghosts. But we will continue to study cooking after that. So would Jessica like to work as a crafter beginning as a leaf folder? Jessica would bring home 50 food and 48 resources a day. Sounds like a winner to me. Jessica has a new career. You will receive a notice when it is time for Jessica to head out to work. Now that I'm finished planning my survival, it's time to work on my plan. Didn't I tell her to read? So what do we need to know? Oh, she is getting skinny. Um, we need to have her exercise. Uh, let's see. She needs one mechanical level. Well, we've got plenty of mechanical, so let's have her study cooking or cleaning for a while. Let's see. Okay. Hurry it up, Missy. Nine to twelve. Hey, it's one of those orangutans. I wonder if if Wayata wants to be friends, or did it come for Spalding? Welcome, my hairy guest. Oh, she needs to go to work. Why is she sleeping? You can't be sleeping. You gotta work. Oh, I wish I could cheat right now. Okay, go. So, I will pick right back up um, after she gets back from, okay, she's done working. I forget that that doesn't take very long. Alright, so, befriend orangutan. I think in order to do that, where did she go? Go here. Give her a banana. Groom. Give her another banana. And then come over here and use the toilet. The bushes. And then chop. Chop. Come over here and chop. Chop. Okay. I wish we could get the butterflies. I'm not gonna give you a treat, you dumb monkey.
Alright, she's befriended a monkey. I'm not gonna give you a treat. Okay, so let's have her come take a swim. And then come over here and light the fire. Level five cleaning. And then we will Tiger shrimp kebab. Okay, that's enough of that. Oops. Okay, that's it. Uh, oh, let's have her. No, yeah, well. Really? Darn fire. Have dinner. Tiger shrimp kebab. Them shrimps got shrimp scampi and shrimp kebab and shrimp soup and shrimp noodles and shrimp. Let's go to sleep. It's raining. Oh, snap! Okay. She wants to adopt the orangutan. Marvelous. Oh. Let's see if we can get electrocuted. Like I accidentally electrocuted my runaway teen. Where is she? Let's study the cooking. <laughs> oh, she gained a body skill. That's one wonderful. Hey, yeah, let's read her journal. Uh, not sure if I read all of these. So. Here goes nothing. Uh, I walked the shoreline and combed the beach for anything useful. I found the exact machete that I wanted for my 10th birthday. Better late than ever. I cleared out the bamboo, hacked a path into the jungle. 
Now I can explore the island and try to help. Oh, try to find help or a date. Hopefully both in one. Am I the first one to set foot in this jungle? It doesn't seem that way. I found a wrecked plane in the jungle. If the pilot survived the crash, they could still be on the island. I will try to be optimistic for both of our sakes. Do you think she's talking about Spaulding? I searched the cop cockpit of the wreckage for supplies, or better yet, a radio. There was a map on the island inside. It's faint and difficult to read, but at least it's a starting point. I think I've read those already. The trek into the jungle was more fruitful than I imagined. I kept exploring to see what else I could find. I found a family of orangutans and some kind of idol. It looks native, but I guess it could have come from the wreckage or the pilot. I want to know more about the idol. I and I want an orangutan. Why does she want an orangutan? I don't get it. There was some kind of idol at the base of the orangutan's tree. I went to get a closer look at it. An orangutan beat me up badly. I was sucker punched and that's all I'm going to say about that. I gathered some bananas to bribe the fighting orangutans. If this doesn't work, I guess I'll have to learn judo or find three other morally liberal orangutans to distract these three. They always said that one can get more flies with honey than vinegar. Well, they sure know they're fighting primates. The orangutans loved the banana bribes. I had them eating out of the palm of my hand, literally. I thought the idol may hold some clues about the island. It took from I took it from the orangutans. I hope they don't call the cops. What am I thinking? Everyone knows that orangutans hate cops. Oh my god. She's so dumb. After hitting my adventure quota for the day, I returned to camp with the idol. Had I known I would be returning with company, I would have spruced up the place a little. Yeah, she's a wackadoodle. Okay. What is she doing? Okay, why don't you come on out? Uh, let's see. And go to sleep. Watch, it's gonna be day here pretty quick. Yeah, that's what I thought. Dad, gum it. Oh well. It's time for Jessica to start going to work. Go to work, Jessica. And then come back here and study cleaning and study cooking. And then write in your journal. And she's back. All right, she got a promotion. Jessica has acquired the skills of a basket weaver. Apparently surviving on a deserted island involves a lot of carrying things back and forth. And there aren't a lot of usable salvaged containers around. Those rushes over there, they could be holding things for you. It looks like underwater basket weaving wasn't such a useless subject in school after all jessica has brought home 63 food and 98 resources today and got a bonus of 126 food with a 196 resources marvelous she's swimming in the resources read 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 let's get those skills up lady Let's get those skills up. Gain a creativity point. We could probably do that. OK. 
Okay, she needs to have a... Oh, she needs to do so she needs logic and she needs creativity okay oh oh cranky all right that's enough of that let's befriend this play stick them up where did she go to write in her journal. Write in journal. Study. What does she want? I think that's cooking. No, that's cleaning. Study cleaning. And then I'm going to go into buy up uh, barter mode. She wants uh, fun cooking loving storage nature I don't think she can do creativity with that she has enough resources. She also wanted a bookshelf. Let's get her this. We'll put it... We'll put it right there. Routing issues much? Okay, she get anything new in there? Oh, crikey. I want to keep the idol close to me. I placed it somewhere nice. It turns out the idol itself was a great way to spruce up the camp. I took a closer look at the idol. For the first time on this island, I'm not all alone. I finally have someone to talk to. Too bad he's the strong, quiet type. It could take quite some time to finish my raft. I needed an overall food and resource gathering plan, so I planned my survival strategy. Plan your work and work your plan. That's what I'm what I always say. Now I have a set schedule for my island job. One of the orangutans from earlier came to my camp. No banana bribes this time. I won this orangutan over with sheer personality. When it rains, it pours. I have two new friends now, Spalding and an orangutan. This is already a better experience for me than my than high school. I thought it'd be nice to have an orangutan around all the time. I adopted it. I can finally strike out pri pet primate from my letters to Santa, which is good since I haven't seen any mailboxes here. All right. Get your social up. And then, after you do that, light the fire. That's probably good enough. She wants a rainwater tower. If Waida helps out around the camp, I can focus on more important skills like getting back home. Let's give job. Um, 
see, let's give him a crafter. Or a, gra a gatherer, rather. Have dinner. Let's have a tropical fruit kebab. And then... Uh, would Waida like to start work? Uh, yeah. Now that I don't have to worry so much about, uh, surplies, I, surplies, bleh, surplies, I can get back to the raft. I need more parts to complete my raft. I'll explore the island and see what I can find. I pretty much don't really usually um, control the orangutan because, well, it just doesn't really make sense to do that. After that, you go to sleep. Alright! That is 27 minutes so far. So I think I'm going to cut out here and um, begin um, episode 5 when she wakes up. And we'll see if we can explore the island some more. So until then, I hope that you have enjoyed this series. And if you would please be so kind as to rate this video, give it a thumbs up, a thumbs down. Um, uh, feel free to comment, uh, like, and subscribe. If you enjoy this series, uh, you might also enjoy my Runaway Teen Challenge for The Sims 3. Um, um, and I really hope that you have had a fantastic, uh, day, week, month, year, um, uh, and bye!